Hey yo together and very welcome to the start of two crazy replays today on Moonlight Madness with a TVT. As we have spawning in the right top position as the blue terran it is Kaup. And he's playing against me, spawning in the left bottom position, it is the red terran Alex Sasha. So I wanted to show you that game because uh, I don't want a spoiler, so let me let me think of how I'm, how I'm putting this. Um, hmm. I wanted to show you guys how much effort it takes sometimes to win a TVT. I can't say more than that. Uh, I will in the end maybe talk two more sentences about that, but for now let's just Enjoy the game. Uh, we have gas first for me. There we go. And barracks first for Kaup. So standard stuff so far. No command center first. Uh, and so far no proxy, no three rigs. Everything standard stuff. Lately I have tried to play a little bit around with the build. So I'm not going for the... For the... Auto turret doom drop all the game on a four player map. I'm going for 15 gas Maru's anti Benji expand, which is really strong. And sometimes I'm going now uh, for the Hellion elevator drop, uh, Hellion marine elevator. So that's also a strong build. I still need to figure out when it hits good, how to micro the Hellions, and how to transition out of it because sometimes ah, it can be very difficult to defend but yeah it can also be quite difficult that, that's quite all inish this this build the uh, hellion marine elevator because you need to deal real damage hellions can wreck scvs but it depends also on the opening of your opponent so yeah we will see for Kaup so far microing a supply depot like a madman he's bored uh, producing a reaper uh, orbital command finishes up and for me we have so far just the marines Interestingly, uh, okay, I can't say yet if it's the elevator drop or not. Uh, second guess, so most likely not, because for the Marine Helen elevator you don't need. The second guess, you're skipping that, you're producing a reactor after the two Marines, you get one Helen as soon as the factory finishes, the starport as soon as you have the gas for it, throw down another supply depot at like 22, 23 supply, you're fine. Oh, he's losing the Reaper there. That's a big blunder. Uh, and then you just produce Marines out of the Reactor Talion. Have the Hellion uh, out of the Reactor Barracks. You have the Hellions at the front. As soon as you have three Hellions, they park here. You grab all the Marines into the Medivac, boost across the map, elevator everything. Somewhere where he doesn't see it, or somewhere where he can't really react. And then you try to just win the game from that. Uh, you got the medivac for the healing power. You got the marines and the hellions. So, but you need to make sure that you line them up. So here's the second reaper. Will scout everything, being a bit of a nuisance. Uh, yep, yeah. might get a kill here. Gets a kill, and most likely does die. Yeah. Oh, being a bit annoying here. There we go. So, two Reaper lost already for one SCV. He got the scouting info, so that's fine. He's producing... Hellions, there's the starport. Okay. Oh, Engineering Bay, he thinks it's Benji. Well, <laughs> you're wrong. You're so wrong. Uh, where are the turrets? No turrets. So, maybe... Hmm. Very interesting. So the Raven is out, so far no turrets, uh, with the Hellion, oh, that Hellion got some kills. And it does escape, oh wow, Hellion hype! Ooh, the chase is on, the chase is on, guys, will the Hell? no, the Hellion will die, most likely. Oh, oh it dies, and he might grab even another Marine there. Oh, maybe not, but that was that was not bad. He got the Hellion, so I should have had 
Not the hell and head up the ramp, but just behind the mineral line. That would be nice, but okay. We got it. Now the turrets are coming. Uh, but here we are. Oh, no, wait. What's, what's that for? Ah. I'm not sure if that's good for the timing, to be honest. Uh, the tank is already 15 seconds too late. I'm just scouting. Ah, okay. So I see. Yeah, there we go. So... This drop might find damage, possibly, maybe not, we will see. He scans, oh he scans, ah, I'm not showing this medivac. Okay, so here we go. Oh no, 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 the tank doesn't fit in there. Oh god, oh god, oh, that delays everything, oh, Woo, that was so close, so now I have to turn back. Uh Oh line him up! Wow that was huge. That was a big mistake. I should have just dropped the tanks and that's it, but wow no. That that, that Wow, that hurts. That really hurts. So now I can't drop anymore. Uh, no way. Uh, with the two Vikings, <laughs> no chance. So I I might try to contest him, but yeah, he got no tanks for now. So that's good. Oh, the Raven. Will I throw down the PDD? Uh, for now it looks like no. The Helians are quite low. He needs a tank. He puts everything. The auto turret though. Ah, oh, that's very not looking good for him. Grabbing that tank. Oh, he's taking so much damage. Look there. Uh, avoiding the fire. Tank Medivac Micro. Okay, so the Vikings will clean the air. There's still the auto turret. He's Oh, he lost so much there. Might even lose a Viking there if he's not careful. Ooh, one Viking. Well, both Vikings so low. The Medivax also sehr, very low. Now two more Hellions. Ah, flying into the missile turret. A big mistake. Uh, the turret falls. The SCVs might die as well. And behind that we see not being too much produced here. The barracks are going down. Uh, he will be forced to lift the orbit command. Three tanks? Are you serious? Oh my god. So he repairs the tanks, uh, the vikings, uh, but he might lose the gas, uh, I should take out the gas, no I wanna go back, uh, because of this tank, oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, ah, oh, all the three tanks might have 12 kills, so how much damage should I do, 18 SCVs, and 12 Hellions, and there you go, there is triple factory, that is mech, and now, I can, I can tell you, this game shows how difficult it is to win as a bio player or marine tank player against someone who goes mech. So watch closely, it is very difficult. And I don't know why Avilo says all the time, oh bio is such a brain IFK uh, style and woo. Maybe you need more positioning with uh, mech. Maybe mech is more the strategic approach than bio, where you need more like the mechanics. But mech is so forgiving with mistakes because of the tank. The tank is so powerful, the helmets are super tanky, the vikings, you can't drop anything. And that's my opinion. Uh, it's very very difficult to win against a mech in Terran. Because of turrets and planetary fortress and tanks and vikings and helmets. And later on Raven Battlecruiser. Have fun with that. And Thor of course. Sure, the Thor. So there we go. Uh, two tanks there. I can't see up there. That's not gonna work. Nope. Losing a tank there. For free. I won't find any damage here. He's getting blue flame. As well as a third command center. He's so far behind. But he can hold this position for now uh, there's no supply depot he doesn't see it he might assume it that I'm going through the debris uh, because where else could I attack right mm. I would love to see me dropping where are the medics I'm supply blocked again of course so because you can't drop the main base you can't drop the natural it's possible he sees it and he repositions his unit so ooh, carefully with your Vikings there the, the goal is, as a bio player, or oh, losing the Vikings, that's bad, is to deny the third base as long as possible. If you... Oh, no, 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 all the Marines are clumped. Tanks are sieging up. 
So that oh with the auto turrets. That's looking good for me. So I'm killing all the tanks. Ah oh, that oh the Benji. There's a Benji. Oh. So I'm resetting the tank count. Uh, the Benji, where does it go? Ooh. So I'm trading away tanks for tanks. And that's not really good. I shouldn't go for the tanks. I might get the tech lab. No, 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 no. That's that's not really good. I was five tanks against two. I should have backed off and saved them with the medivacs, which I should have gotten out already, but it's so late. So at least I reset his tank count, but mine as well, which is not very good. The only good thing is uh, the orbital command has to fly in the circle to avoid damage. I would just not care. It costs you so much more time, but this turret will be in range there. Yeah. So his gun goes down. Uh, yeah, he sees it. There's a Benji. There are turrets, so you won't find too much damage. This gas guys are not fully saturated. This is oversaturated, so... Pew pew! So, 8 damage here. Oh. Yeah, you need you need the big boys. Uh, there's a raven! Oh my god, my raven stays there for... Oh my god, this! He's getting no viking! Why? What? Are you kidding me? So here's a big drop, a small drop, doing some damage, blue flame hands will clear this. Oh, and gunning down the orbital command, he needs to repair it. Uh, it's okay, he pulls all this. This raven, are you kidding me? It's still there, oh my goodness. So he has to lift the orbital command again. This is very key, my upgrades are rolling. That's good, I'm taking another base, denying the third base. Uh, <laughs> the raven. Oh yeah, so... Ah, uh, the Benji might get, come on. Oh, my reaction is so off. Uh, I get the Benji for a tank. That's uh, no, I should have not lost that tank. Uh, he tries to go back here. Scan goes down, sees nothing. Oh no 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 no! Deny that one again. It's so low. Okay, now he got enough uh, to win that. Uh, some auto turrets and bye bye. Not gonna matter at all. Now you should have oh, so many turrets. But still, you can go he around here and drop there. Or there. It is possible. So the good thing is, I still have the raven. So later on, yeah, there. Oh, you drop there. Just in front. And go straight for the auto command. I should go for the tank instead. Yeah, I'm a bit under indecisive. Which is costing me a lot of stuff. Uh, I'm killing some SCVs. But overall, that's not looking too good. I might get the raven. Oh no, not paying attention there. So, overall unit lost type quite equal. He lost a lot of SCVs, he's down in SCVs. He still wasn't able to saturate the space. Uh, oh god, there we go. Another attack. Try to gun down this orbital command and I might get it! So, so close! Oh, the mule repair. So close. So, he saves it, but still no gas is taken here. And he still sticks on siege tanks, siege tanks, siege tanks, and hellions and halberds. I'm taking aggressively another base. Not sure why not that one, but I think I just don't care. I can't attack here, so... Oh, I might drop just on top of the tanks. Oh yeah, there we go. Lower the tank count, drop on top of that. Stim to win, baby. I should take out that one. There we go. Benji runs out of energy. Uh, he clears it. And that were like four medivacs full of units died for nothing, but two tanks. Still very difficult to hold. His, his upgrades aren't that great. One one against two two bio and zero one there. There's a counter attack. Mm, not gonna do anything. I should plant down a bunker behind the mineral line, something like that. So now he sees my army right there. And there are still two tanks here, so I don't know about that. I'm really stimming in. Oh, I'm going for the tanks. Yeah, you can do that. It works, you see. Two tanks is okay. And he might lose a lot of SCVs here again. Look at that. There's a Benji. Uh, but oh, look at all those SCVs dying. That's huge. At the same time, there's a counter attack with the Hellions. But it looks like I might get some kills here. Well, maybe not. I got some SCV kills, which is good, but he got mules, so... Yeah, he's really annoying. That Hellion. Oh, wow. 
So, morphing that one into an orbital command, that's good. But he still survives, and now he can saturate the gas geysers and slowly but surely go into something more heavier, like. Yeah, Raven, for example, or Thor, something like that. But still, the supply tells the story. Uh, and I need to trade. It's so damn even. This is really difficult. But there's still the Hellion. There we go. Goes in. Not really. There we have an engagement. Uh, I'm not sure about that. This won't work at all. That's, that's not... No, no, this... It doesn't work. Too many tanks. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the repair on the tank is real. So there's the Hellion. Killing a lot of stuff. Being super annoying. Oh my goodness. Uh, six kills on that one. So three more Hellions are coming in. Oh no. He scans. Did he scan? Yeah, why would he scan? Oh, one Hellion survives. Oh no. Killing even more stuff. Being super annoying. And soon the real problem starts when Cope manages to take a fourth base. That's then really difficult to hold. 3-3 uh, three, three on the way. Look at that. Really nice. But will I be able to, to deal damage? I mean, his upgrades are late. That's really good. He's still on 1-1. One, one. But other than that... I'm not quite sure. My Bioforce is not really strong. It's not really big. Uh, I'm going for the Raven. Finally, the air transition. That's exactly what I need. Uh, but it's, it's very difficult. Second Armory on the way. A bit unnecessarily considering I all were, almost got 3-3. Three, three, a plus 3 attack on already. Uh, oh, that Banshee! So many kills! Whoa! So, he's dealing very good damage there, with that Banji. Oh, wow. Yeah, those were all the kills on that Banji, I guess. I'm not quite sure, but... No, not all, but a lot. I got no Viking yet, so... Oh, wait, there are three Vikings. Okay, but yeah, I can't really deal with that Banji there. Uh, the turrets are going down, which is good, I guess, but I'm giving him so much time. He could grab the third base, a uh, fourth one. Uh, scans are going down, so I can chop through the debris. There's a raven, no turret. Oh. That's gonna be interesting. There's a raven, so what do I do? Seeker missile? Auto turret? Oh, look at that. Um... Gets even more SCV kills, oh wow. <laughs> that Banshee is so annoying. So he still wasn't able to, to get a fourth base, which is really hurting him right now. He's finally getting 2-2. Two -two. Uh, all those tanks eating up. Bye bye bio. Uh, might get the sensor to it. Nope. He pulled so many SVs all the time. Oh my goodness, no, don't throw away all the marines! Uh, there's a double drop here? Oh wow. Oh! Oh, it dies! And that one, maybe as well. Oh my. <laughs> Very ineffective drop, I have to say that. Now there's a small bioforce out of the range of the sensor turret, so he doesn't know. So for now, he just doesn't know, but. More scans going down. Sees that I'm going for Raven. How many Raven are there? Just seven. Twenty tanks! Wow! So I might go in right now and deal real damage. There we go. There's the big engagement. He has to pull back all those tanks here. Uh, this could be good, I guess. He goes in. Tanks are sieging up Hunter Seeker missiles on all those tanks. He might lose some of them for sure. Oh, big explosions. Yeah, now he loses all the tanks with the bio. And I guess, there we go, GG. But very difficult, very difficult. It took me so long to take engagement. In the end, he committed too much to siege tanks and had nothing to buffer. But yeah, it is, it is very difficult. Very difficult. I mean, I dealt so much damage early on, but the transition wasn't crisp enough. 
And then I wasn't able to really finish it. I lost 5 tanks here for no reason. I traded bad poorly. Uh, 3 times here. And I don't even want, want, want to know how difficult it is to win against a mech Terran if you're equal in terms of economy and supply. If you're not able to harass the third base. This must be so difficult. So yeah, that's that. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. As always, I wish you a very nice day. And